What's up guys, this is the Brofman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. So to run off of my last time we had an epic siege of Moscow that went on for much longer than I ever anticipated and now we are defending against a sally from the Hurons. So hopefully a bit more of a laid back one. So let's fight. It will knock out another faction's turn time counter. Um, soon actually we'll get rid of the Huron, the... Uh, the Norwegians and also the Plains Mountains. It will it will just be and the Marathas. Okay, so let's go. Do something a bit more conventional. Don't know why I pick five. I think five just gives me a it's a nice long line. Oh, it's got rockets in this one. So these guys are gonna have Cavalry defences, because they've got more they've got more cavalry than they do. They have more cavalry than they do firearm infantry to worry about. And the, the bows, while annoying, do eventually get knocked out by um, master fire. So let's put you guys can deploy here. My scouts can deploy set in front of the guns. Let's drop my houses back. Find quick lime and then let's put my rocket somewhere in the open. Cool. My colonial lights, they're not gonna do much this battle. Rockets fire. Let's actually observe what they do. So he's loading his rockets up. Although they're pro targeting us in a unit of armed tribes. Okay, hold on. What's your range? Does look pretty cool. It's not bad. So this artillery, you start to use all the advantages of modern artillery. It's pretty cool. Let's just have a look. Firepower is good. The range is really good. The range is the longest range weapon I've got. So I might using it to bombard some art, some forts might be a good idea. They're slow to reload, and the firepower is not brilliant, but it's more firepower than a than a howitzer. Hmm. I'll have to experiment with that actually a little bit. Okay, let's just switch to canister. Close range rocket fire. There's no rockets to snipe at the chief's bodyguard. Nope, don't stay where you are. Don't go crazy. Okay. Massed bows on this flank. Yeah, they're all falling back. Okay, let's do this. charge into the bows right now because these guys are going to get shot to pieces so don't worry about them. Let's do this to hound off the bows. Oh no! Okay good, they're aiming close. Mm. 
Braves are still firing. Go hit the Native American warriors. Impetuous, because they've probably called some sort of war cry. Let's pull back. Okay, I, I see you bowmen over here. Smash straight into them. Who are you shooting at now? Ooh, these guys that have come back. Missed. Just keep chopping them down until they shatter. Good. Armed tribesmen, garrison. Okay, now you go down this garrison bow unit. Just avoid this melee unit until they start to wander into range. Enemy general has been killed. Then on this far flank... Ah, oh, it's because the general's charged. That'll do it. Hey, had the audacity to try to run through the spikes, did he? Spin you guys around the right way. Just let these guys do a bit of a have a bit of a spree because right now these guys should well, let's target my artillery against them too up here they come here comes the rockets okay it's pretty 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 cool actually I quite enjoy having those things just arcing up over the battlefield up here come the howitzers Okay, here comes the general again. Charge in, let's turn off. Okay, you go back and charge them. Maybe just keep running, because you'll eventually run them into your into my cavalry spikes. It's all five of the rockets too. Smashing this unit of armed tribesmen that's come back. At least you're tired, but god damn, the colonial light -like cavalry, you're gonna. You're gonna do your duty. Okay, let's get them out, because they're dying quite quickly. Howitzers engage the armed tribesmen, as can my rockets. And all of you hit that bowman unit, because the chief's probably done. Comes the howitzers. Here comes the rockets. Beautiful. Okay, don't know. Oh, oh, end the battle for sure. Because it's a Sally, and I suspect it's probably the last one. It's the last turn they can withstand the siege. Oh no. Tune is. Population's shrinking because of famines. Toronto's grown, so let's just add more. Oh no, that was the end. So let's put a steam pump gold mine, knock down the chief's lodge, upgrade the trapper place, destroy the meeting hall, and destroy this meeting hall. Infrastructure's good, but you're just not connected. 
Let's replenish, and this army will be ready to follow up on an attack on the the, uh, the Black Hills. You're still moving up on Mexico. And then... New rated Puerto Cabello. Abraham Axford. It's probably going to be just an auto resolve because. Yeah, look at that. That's not that's not a battle worth fighting. I mean, obviously, I lost more men than I could have done, but. Let's put walls in because why not? So the Swedes have been cheeky little chaps. Just quickly smash their fleet with mine. Yeah. And I'll claim your second rate. I'll just hop them on there. Good, not though, not that I really need the income on 270,000 per turn. Making nothing on trade, it's all on tax, because I'm not trading with anyone. <laughs> I'm producing all these goods, but no one wants them. Sigh. Fleet arrives. Oh yeah. No, hold on. Oop. Okay, so who is... Aha! May as well take it. Okay, so to be honest, because I'm not trading, my, the value here is just stopping their trade. Good. That and raiding their supply lines gets me more money than more money than I can actually get from trading the resources myself. Darling of the Gutter Press. So that's my guy in Moscow. Who Jesus needs some replenishment. And recruitment. You can get some two units of Republicans and Guards and get Oh god, he can't I can't recruit many guard infantrymen. Get two riflemen scouts. Oh, six units. Six units, perfect. You're gonna quickly take out this annoying little stack. Huzzah! Huzzah! Good, you're going to, you're already replenishing and you're going to get a unit of, oh you're already getting a howitzer unit. Yes. Replenish, 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 keep everyone replenishing, make sure everyone's okay. So the Russians are falling back so I want to keep pushing them, or keep, keep giving them things to think about. Ooh, metal roads, aren't they beautiful? Sprint straight to... Oh, right. F take them out first. Because I don't want to have any of these fragments running around, being a nuisance. So you pin the garrison. You move up, ready to support. Maneuvers complete. Because this is going to be an interesting scrap. But one thing I do want to do yes, sir. Ready for is take. You've got no howitzers. Yes, you've got. Two, you've got two. Ooh, okay. So the Swedes are blocking our path. Ready so let's order. shunt these guys up a little Make bit. Ready. Ready. Because first, I want to knock out yes, their sir. ally. Ready I'm probably going to want to assault with... Okay, they got lots of fusiliers, elite units, and lots of... Trouble is, with lots of these... Like it's so much artillery, but it's just not needed to knock out... Well, in a fort battle, it's just not... You should rather, rather have the troops, so... Let's take a US Marine unit... And transfer it to the other oh. army to give me a bit more elite. And then these howitzers will do most of the job. But let's do this to knock out the uh, the Swedes' remaining ally. This will be a bit of a double faction knockout. This section, this session will be because that will have been, yeah, the Huron and the the Norwegians gone in one fell swoop.
I mean, I don't count the pirates, because the pirates are always independent. <laughs> Similar plan. A couple of guns set up. You guys set up here. And these guys set up over here. My howitzers find somewhere a bit central. Gun teams only need two on this level of settlement. And then let's do go for a double envelopment. So let's put... Oh, okay, I deploy all the way back here. So you go on one flank, and all these guys go... Go over here, to then deploy over here and ready to hit this side of the city. Of, oh, they've deployed artillery outside of the uh, outside of their walls. Interesting. So here comes the royal, the last army of Norway. Lots of light infantry. Doing damage, they've knocked out, they've killed some of my howitzer crews, but not any of the, not any of the guns themselves. Are they going to sally out and skirmish? Okay, let's change our direction of travel. Maybe not hit this side, but hit more this corner good lovely destruction of that militia unit Decided against their skirmish. No, they haven't. They're moving up. So run those guys. Because one more volley would be enough to destroy this section. are running to charge as well. Okay, you hit the guns. You hit the light... Well, to most, you both hit the light infantry. You hit the guns. And you guys get ready. There's another light infantry unit sallying out. with their own artillery, but it's just not doing anything but damaging their own buildings. Let's get rid 
already. I want to make sure we've got both the breaches in place. One more shot would do it. Oh, that is devastatingly good quick climb shooting. Not even more. One more volley of foot artillery. That's going to be it. Let's get all my artillery just to keep firing with... Not shot, shot, round shot. Just keep pounding the guys that are up on the top of the wall. Ideas, secure the tower. Will you secure the gate? These guys hunker down and wait. You climb out the right, you climb out the left. These guys are here just to block block the uh, to block the gate. Form square. Yeah, it's un understandable that my guys would start to rout. Climb the gate. There you go, the sailing forces are going to get shot to pieces. May as well climb, rather than standing there getting shot at. These guys run and engage this section of line infantry. Okay, then don't. Instead, run and join in on this combat like everyone else. Go on, men. Climb the ladders. This gatehouse is ours. Let's just get these guys to secure the gatehouse so they will just pour musket fire into the centre. You, garrison guards, I'd like to get support of them. You hot fire, so I'm sending one unit into each breach. fly with this artillery and let's start dropping round shots on the general's bodyguard.
try to get off the walls. These guys are going to line up. Let's take out these last four guys. One unit of cover and it's all he needs to screw it all up. Okay, maybe these guys also engage the cavalry. These guys just make everyone engage the cavalry because right now it's all this uh, this whole area is just broken because Gates ours, but not ours, and it is, and it isn't at the same time. No, not you. Oh. Okay, just go get involved. New guys now charge. They've made a valiant account of themselves. However, it was not enough. Let's halt my howitzer fire. There you go, the cavalry is routing, so everyone just pouring. Out this one last chap, push him off the side of the wall. Throw him over the side. Just killed one of your mates. We just stumped. Oh, someone better get him. Got him. You could charge them. You charge the gunner. It's one remaining gunner. Ooh. There you go. He's not taking any mess in. And these guys are about to get annihilated. God, that's brutal. Let's end it there. Lovely, lovely capture. Oh, a bit quicker. Not that they're that slow anyway. They were slow originally. Christiana is ours. Fix the palace. Do some repairs. And do you have a university? You do. So if I knock that down, you'll love me. Because that's minus 16 and you're minus 9. So that's brilliant. So these guys march up. Continue to push inland. Russia's making no money from here. So let's just bunch these up. Go to a church school and let's build a put another church school actually see if we can reverse this her heretical swinery at the ready then who do Make I ready. want yes sir you probably then again no oh, they've got rockets and mortars oh, I think I'm gonna want to do Something Seven. like this. Then effectively we will be fighting the final battle of the Swedish on the map. Because once we fight this and these armies are destroyed, Stockholm will be ripe for the taking. So thanks for watching guys.
Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the final destruction of the Scandinavian Peninsula. Cheers. Thank you.